Okay, the Naven novice is made in chase. One for the chases this time over two and a half miles. Number one is heading home. Two is Torfian Street. Three, game set match. Four, gravy train. Five, nevertheless. Six, ride on pony. Seven, stray bullet. And eight, sun driver. Again, a very small maiden field here. Just the eight of them. Obviously don't like travelling over to Ireland. Uh, straight into the first fence and everybody's over it. Although gravy train was rather slow. And it's just dropped right back to the back so leading up front it's a heading home and nevertheless there'll be an over one front runner and a Carl Arroganti front runner quite well known now in fact we've got probably four people that tend to have front runners which is serious chill Carl Arroganti Derek Hinton and obviously John Morgan and let's see how they fare as the season goes but anyway we're through two and it's nevertheless it's going to lead us from heading home in second some drivers third already getting a little bit strong out here I mean, there's only probably 10 lengths between first and last but uh, they've gone indian file up front the gray stray bullet is in fourth then we've got ride on pony for martin leading against the fence they take the third just on the uphill there the one that didn't get into it well at all was torfian street for darren thompson and then riding along there is game set match and What's the other horse I missed? Gravy Train, which is against the fence in the green silks. So as they approach the next, still going under two miles to travel. Oh, nevertheless, went straight through the top of that, not done himself any favours. Gravy Train didn't jump it very well either towards the rear. So these uh, maidens are acting like it, but it still nevertheless leads. Just by a length from Stray Bullet, heading home's jockey having a little bit of a rest now. Pulls him back into third. They can approach the fifth. Oh, we've lost one there. Sun Driver's gone. And I'm not sure who that is. Because I don't recognise those orange silks. Uh, I know Ride right on Ponies Martin. I know Martin had uh, orange silks last year. So bad luck to connections there. But still, nevertheless, leads by now a couple of lengths to Stray Bullet and heading home. And there are a couple of lengths back from Torfian Street that's got himself into a much better position now. Then we've got probably three lengths back to Gravy Train, Game Set and Match and Ride on Pony and the Loose Horse Sun Driver. So, nevertheless, takes him around this bend. He's going to approach the next, which will be number seven, which will be halfway through the fences here, with a mile and a quarter still to travel. Nevertheless, just settling his horse into the seventh here, allowing Torfian Street to cut his lead down. So it always takes it better. Everybody jumped that one well. So it's nevertheless, from straight, straight bullet and Torfian Street flip-flopping for second and heading home. In good position. And there are a couple of lengths ahead of game set match, gravy train and ride on ponies. Just a couple of lengths at the rear, bowling along with Sun Driver, the riderless horse. So into the ninth. Oh, and I thought we were losing heading home there. To, certainly took a dive at it. But they're through it. And they're all still on their feet. And it's nevertheless just by two now to Stray Bullet and Torfian three. Heading home four. Gravy Train five. They go into the tenth. Oh, and we've lost one there. Shipped his jockey. Game set and match for Josh. Gone. Bad luck. Need some mat super glue in the saddle. But it's nevertheless the one that we can't see now is Ride on Pony. He's got a bit detached, probably. Uh, he's certainly got caught for toe here. And there's nothing wrong with that one. But they're going to this ditch, the 11th. With just three left. It's nevertheless, it still leads. But just uh, being pushed along now to maintain the lead from Straight Bullet in second. Torfian Street looking good. Heading home under a bit of pressure now, but got nowhere to go. One on the outside is Gravy Train and Ride on Pony somewhere. So as we take this bend, and we're going to there down the hill and settle up for the judges as they go into the 12th two to go and it's still nevertheless that leads us but here comes Torfian Street still not really being ridden along nevertheless he's starting to pull away now I'm so not careful there he hasn't uh, got away for the rest of them here so it's nevertheless still two to jump they can approach the 13th it's nevertheless from Torfian Street stray bullet staying on here comes heading home as well gravy train and ride on pony have got a lot to do so we hit the two furlong pole one left to jump nevertheless here comes straight bullet and Torfian Street to challenge but nevertheless is still there we've only just got over a furlong left to travel it's nevertheless still in the lead but stray bullet pulling alongside it'll be to the jump nevertheless is a little bit slow stray bullet was better it's between these then neck and neck finding a half a furlong nevertheless stray bullet nevertheless nevertheless it's just got half a furlong baby half a length sorry it's nevertheless it's going to take it from stray bullet in second toffee and street third nobody else never nearer so a great win there for carl arroganti led from the 
start. Called a march on these. The one that just couldn't get up in time was a uh, stray bullet. Maybe just left it a little bit late. Torfian Street. So good win there for Nevertheless for Carl Arrogante. Second was stray bullet for David Robertson. Third was Torfian Street for Mr. Thompson. Four was heading home for Obi-Wan. And five was ride on pony for Martin Leadham.